Can we get... <gasps> there is something. There is something. <gasps> Look at that. Holy shit. Watch how you go. There's a trap. Oh, excuse me, what? Vestarian, darling. Would you mind disarming that? Bellathene, oh. do not. Like, I scolded her like she's my child. <laughs> oh, we still got this. I'm not worried. Easy. All right, crude chest, weave moss. Can't give up now. Crude chest, but oh, notes. Can we open this? I'm sure a starion can. I would I like this. My bag. A scrap paper containing what appears to be ideas for a love letter. Oh no, is this from a gobble? I'm so rusty on my, like, Cockney accent. Can't compare her to the moon or stars or any of that rubbish because she lives underground. She ain't got any scabs or boils, so can't compliment the best ones. Oh my god, is he talking about a drow? Oh no. Might think I'm too small till I buy a footstool for it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> When we're kissing. Put some dead spiders in my hair next time I see her. Probably just send her some bits of people what I kill. Oh my god. Um, buddy, don't do it. Don't do it. She'll just kill you. No hate on the kissing footstool? Never. Never. It was just the imagery. It was just the imagery. Oh my god. Can you unlock this for me, darling? Let's crack it open. Okay, we're gonna give this man guidance. Easy. Like we've done it all our life. Ooh, 35. Nice. Thank you. Looking ahead. No. Let me. Let me, please. Thank you. All right. Oh, we've got parchment. Maybe another letter. Silver ingot. Ah! A hill giant finger. Yeah, usually it's a hill giant finger nail that you need for the elixir of hill giant strength. I I don't need the whole finger. Gross. Mud methods. A great axe. Some wine. And oh! A pegasus feather. Very cool. Oh, what does it say? At best, an optimistic leather. Okay, let's read it. Um, where would you... Right there? A childish doodle of a goblin presenting a fungal bouquet to a drow adorns his crumpled letter. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Can we go talk to this man about this when we're done? Dearest your excellency, your most <laughs> most prettiest Minthara, you might not remember me. I ain't nobody important after all. Not yet. <laughs> oh my god. I was chasing chickens with the lads when you came to visit Bulls Ragslin. You looked right at me when you told him that if we was as good as killing humans, if we was at plucking poultry, we might be worth a damn. Made me feel proper special to be recognized like that. Next raid, I saw so much blood, the absolute will have to notice me. Then I'll come to Moonrise and you'll notice me too. I'm the one with the stompy leg and the gummy eye. <laughs> no! <laughs> Clogger. Oh my god. I love it so much. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna go talk to Clogga right the fuck now. Alright, back we go. The stumpy leg and the gammy eye. Can you imagine? Oh no, I don't wanna go this, I wanna go there. Oh my gosh. 
We don't want any of this. Oh no, is she is she so hot I'm gonna have to cosplay her? Yeah. I only need I need white body paint and probably two shades of purple. I've got the gray already, and then I can do a drow skin tone. Alright. So can we do this wooden chest? It looks like it's okay. Big boy. Hold on, I'm gonna save first before I fuck around and find out. I do have an old white wig too, but I doubt the hair is straight white. I'll have to dye it a little. What now? We're going to need a starion for this. How oh, for a skeleton key? There we go. Easy. Okay, and then we'll go talk to Klaga. Alright, what hmm. now? Can I get into it? Oh, I just have some gold. Cool. That's fine. You've seen one of them nose on clubs. I haven't Rough really been looking at the loot. Because I just assume I can't have anything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, stop pissing everywhere. Oh my god. You're not Clogger, so I don't care. Someone ought to roast that shit. I should speak up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna embarrass this we man. To sneak the druid out of this. Get any joy out of the poem? Load of nonsense in it. I can't Absolute talk to God. him about it. Disappointed. Okay, so I'm gonna have to get in there. Dang, we hunted him down in everything. So this is the obstacle course for the baby. Oh. That's, oh, can we have that art? Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's get up here. These are nice chairs. Or at least they used to be. Rotten Temple, Grass House. Oh, well, I guess it wasn't important. I was making sure it wasn't like uh, art from Divinity Original Sin. So I don't want to miss any of that. <sighs> um, we didn't read that poem, but we can. Is it this one? Dwarf's poem. A eulogy for a Selenite who died in the dark below. Notes about a door under the temple are written in the margins. Are we going to the Underdark? Because I was... A son of Selene fell here in the dark below. And we sealed his grave in our holy glow. May the moon never touch the stars once more. May darkness never conquer the moon made in store. A note is scrawled in the margins. Found the door under the temple. Think the moon's turn, but which way? A cluster of stars and lunar phases are sketched beneath. Ooh. Ooh, very cool. Okay, so we don't need to go over here at all. We can potentially... Oh, there's lots of stuff to do over there. Oh, wait. How do I get up to here? Probably not. Right now, because I don't see any ladder. Oh, I see that. We just do our best. All right, goblin scimitar. Why would I want a goblin scimitar? Oh, I'm not gonna steal anything because I don't want to fuck up. What we've got going here. Is it nighttime or are they just taking a nap? Oh, I can go here. What is that? Ew. Okay, so we've got these. Oh, shit. What else is up here? Just a bunch of sleeping gobbos? Where did Volo get off to? Maybe they took him inside? There's somebody up there. Okay, yeah, I guess we explore. Do we wake people up? Oh. Okay. 
Okay. Looks like the boot. Oh. Whoa. I didn't click on it again. It just cut her off. They did mention a cage for Volo, but I didn't see him, so maybe he's inside in a cage? They're sleeping. Oh, they're both there, sleeping too. Krasmok. Araga. Christpok. Araga. I don't speak that language. Mm. Move for me. Don't mind if I do. Alright, let's get up there. Oh, I don't... Wait, where are you going, baby? Bell? Two hours later. I don't know where she thought she was going. God, there's so much to look at. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna have to force her up. Oh, heck. My head hurts bad. You crash about like a drunken ogre. Sorry. Drow was so clumsy. Excuse Leave me? Leave us to rest. You can't talk to me like that. <laughs> Survival failed? Oh, really? heck. My head hurts bad. You crash about like a drunken ogre. Oh, rip your tongue. Break your legs. Make you quiet. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Well. What is her highest? Oh, one, 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 three. Oh, I should probably give her self-guidance. Oh, it's just a two? Jesus. I hear the absolute in you. Do not disturb me again, true soul. Well, let's just have Bell carry on. Um, I think I missed the if survival, over, though. So there's a, a dig up here, but I'll get Shadowheart on it in a second. What's over here? Oh, I see what she was pathing to. But what's over here? Oh! What's in here? Oh my god. Elixir of heroism, diluted oil of sharpness, elixir of the colossus. Cool. I don't want that hand axe, but. Alright, we'll go see if I can figure out the dig spot. It should be nearby, though. Oh, Will's got something to say. Give me a second, Will. I don't know. Where oh, it's right there. Start digging. Sure, that sounds good. Nothing but dirt. Okay. Nothing? Oh, there it is. That was weird. Oh, God. Arcane cultivation. More elixir of the co Colossus. Ham. Pork, pig, and a javelin. Wow, they all have something to say. Always a pleasure. So the tadpole allows us to influence others. How very interesting. Baby. Influence, yes. But a power born of elithids is not one to take lightly. I would urge you to exercise caution. 
<clears throat> you have the ability to manipulate people, make them bend to your every whim, and you'd be cautious about it. <laughs> That's no fun. Oh my god, baby, please. Eh, help us out. Says here the goblinoids are obstreperous and malodorous. What's that mean? It does mean, I know malodorous is smelly, but I'm not familiar with the other word. So I'm just gonna go with one. It means smelly and noisy. Ain't that the truth? Proper stink around here. Now we've settled it. And all that ruckus makes it hard to concentrate on reading. Where did you find that? Belong to some bloke who showed up here asking questions. Oh no, Volo. Bold as a bugbear he was. Said he's writing a book about the absolute. Lads didn't like that. Oh Said he God. was a spy or some such. Think they've locked him in the cells already. Mm. Well, I had a good chin wag with him, though. Interesting bloke. Rollo, why? Let me see his manuscript. I ain't finished with it. There's enough reading here to last me a lifetime. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. You're going to give me that manuscript. I don't have a drow one. You should spend your time in prayer, not reading this nonsense. Mm. We're doing cleric things, we'll use guidance. It's not like we have much of a DC. <gasps> I ran my fucking mouth! I have three inspiration. can't believe. Jesus. Suppose you're right. Absolute rewards faith, not book learning. Take it. Maybe if I pray hard enough, I'll get some of that boo yag for myself. There we go. All right, let's see if he has anything else to say about Volo. Or Halson. You should go get a drink before the party dies, Dan. Are you telling me what to do? <laughs> I'm laying into this drow so hard. <laughs> so there was, okay, so that, but I want this. Oh, okay, so I can read it, but not steal it. If you try to understand the weave, a true pity. But only they who are truly attuned to the weave can rightly call themselves spellcasters. Thus comes the question, what is the weave? It is an essential element of the universe. It runs through everything in unseen hands. It is what makes magic possible. It is also, though I will not go into further detail here, the goddess Mistra herself. See, magic of the weave, Mistra and the spell play. The weave isn't magic precisely. Rather, it is the raw material from which magic is woven. Not entirely unlike how a collection of threads is shaped and formed into a garment. Those with the necessary talent and skill can manipulate the weave and perform magic by casting spells. Developing this skill takes years of learning and constant practice. You might have heard of those who can cast spells because they are born with an innate connection to the weave, commonly called sorcerers. Or worse, because they struck a bargain with an otherworldly creature, also known as warlocks. Do not be deceived. Their magic is unpredictable, uncontrolled, and in some cases, not even rightfully theirs. No. To truly know and manipulate the weave is an art. But those wizards who master it will know the limitless power and beauty the weave provides. Oh my goodness. Alright. We can't take it, but we can read it. 
Okay, so we got all of the top part. We gotta go in, talk to this man. So, let's get down there. Here we go. Letting the rest of the party catch up. Do we got Will? We got Will. No go inside. Inside boy. Oh, no, I'm definitely going inside. I to put my hands on everything. Oh, okay, we're in. Oi! Ain't no party in here! We're doing the absolutes work! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. I've got an audience with the one in charge. You one of those moonrise types, then? Your kind usually don't deal with Boss Ragsley and Priestess Gut. Guessing you're after Mimfara. Could be her blood by the looks of you. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. I've got an audience with Minthara. <laughs> audience is right. She's an uppity one and no mistake, but she knows her business. She's in telling the war chiefs what's what. Next raid's gonna be a big one, I hear. Oh, no, they're gonna raid the grove. So Luna, as if mingling with a horde of goblins wasn't bad enough. Let's do what we have to do, then get out of here. Excuse me, what do you mean by that? What do you mean by that, Shadowheart? Shadowheart's talking about having to be in a Selenite temple. Not that she dislikes a drow. Not your usual haunt, I take it? Quite the understatement, but yes. Let's not linger in this place any more than necessary. It's always a pleasure to see you sauntering over. Okay, we didn't have anything. It was just, uh... We got him now, eh? No one's... <laughs> Being boozing won't make the branding go any easier. I tried. Oh my goodness. Oh, smell that meat sizzling. Can't tell if it's the branding or the party. Making me bloody hungry either way. Gross. It's good you ain't causing trouble. Boss means business, now he's got the absolute in his ear. Ah, those thieves almost got past! Okay, so they've got people we got here. Them, I once the whelp start singing. We don't we'll care enough to them. go up and talk oh, to them. Maybe we get them might be. We'll pay on the way them a back. Visit in return. That'll be some real fun. <laughs> okay, so this is a pretty straightforward shot. Trying to get a lay of the I'm land. Only here for you, priestess. True That's soul. Scott, i.e. priestess Scott, I'm assuming. Oh, more people. Where's Halson? I don't want the golden priestess. I want Halson. God, there's so much. Oh, wait, there's a. And then I'll hear her voice. Great down there. You're too feeble. Her voice is a blade. Oh, vile idolatry. Makes my stomach turn. Oh my gosh, calm down. For once, the goblin's decorations are an improvement. She's giving... I'm in a rivalry with another popular girl in high school. Ain't polite to stare, Wormwalt. If you ain't got the guts to get branded, clear off. You can't talk to me like that. But I can't kick his teeth in, so...
Look at this. That's God's mark. Okay, so they don't really have anything oops Faith substantial. Leave me alone. I ain't got time for chatter. Okay. Okay, so we gotta go up here. Nobody's gonna push us around anymore. <laughs> God, there's so much to look at. <laughs> Oh. oh! Hello? Oh my god. Oh my god, we have to go save this person. Who are you? What? There's so much shit going on. Leave this person alone. Oh no. Poor lad. I could give you peace, you know. But no. You gotta keep silent, don't you? Where do they flee to? You stubborn rat! Please! Stop! This is the new kid from the mercenary group. Oh, a drow. I, I, I didn't see you there. Please, uh, if you want to have a try. Why are you torturing him? A git snuck in here with his mates, looking for some forgotten thing. Said they ran to some kind of grove. He doesn't want to tell us where it is. But he can't resist forever. Of course, now that you're here, we'll gladly let you take over. The hope is that I can free this guy and he can run back to the grove. I don't know how the fuck he's going to be able to get out of here, but maybe he'll join our party, kind of like the guy we saved from the burning building. That's, that's the hope here. I don't try. I get results. Move aside. Oh, oh, of course. There's weapons in the fire if you want them. Uh, uh, we'll leave you to it. Okay, good. Come, Grush. Let's go. I don't think I got the stomach for this. I want to watch that weird priest next door. Oh, God. Sounded like he was beating something up. Oh, yeah, beating it good. Drow torture is a little renowned. Um, in one of the games, Belle's mom, actually, so the matron mother of her house, House Davian Lear. Um, I, I remember going to visit her in character as Bellathine once, and she had her patron laid out on a table and restrained. And she had flayed his flesh so that the skin covering his rib cage was ex was pulled back, exposing his actual ribs. And she was carving scrimshaw into his ribs while he was awake and alive. Um, and if you're not familiar with scrimshaw, it's just like wood carving, bone carving, um, like whittling, I guess for lack of a better term. So, uh, that actually happened in one of my games. All right, so, um, ooh. I wish I had a bag of holding. I do wish I had a bag of holding. Oh, Jagged Spear, it's green. Okay, all right, babe, let's get you down. How can I talk to him? Oh, there we go. Please, please, let me out. There's no reason for this. I do feel like she would let him down first. There's no reason to talk now and we could let him go and then talk to him. So let's see if we can't pick the lock. I saw somebody running in the background and I got spooked. I think a sarn would be much better about this. But we got it. The lock clicks and opens. 
Poor thing. Thank you. I, I, I better go before they catch us. Please be careful. I should be able to make it to the grove on my own. They need to know they're in danger. They do. Tell me, have you seen a druid called Halson? Halson? I, I don't know. He changed into a bear, but I lost sight of him. I don't know if he's still alive. You're okay, hun. You came looking for the night song, didn't you? Y yes. It should be here somewhere. They said there was a hidden passage underneath this temple. The place was supposed to be abandoned, but when we arrived, I feel like asking about this is shitty. He's gone through so much. He basically told us all this stuff, so I'm gonna let the poor man leave. Yay, Will got inspiration! See, Will, we were doing sweet things. You just gotta trust. Okay, he's Audi. How did you... Okay, all right. Um, maybe we explore that when we've got Halson. Okay, now I gotta see what this shit's about. Can I talk to these rats? Little babies? Didn't he call himself a master? Would have thought he'd be more creative. Alright. Who the fuck are you, dude? Bolo's right next door. Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. You recognize the Scourge. This man is a follower of Leviathar, goddess of pain. Ah, are you also here to assist with the prisoner? Bell's probably like, at least two or three times his age. What do you mean? I was invited to teach them some of my techniques. I live for pain and its intricacies, you see. But alas, these goblins seem to thrive on the crude and primitive. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? What is a follower of the Maiden of Pain doing here? Ah, you are familiar with the Scourge Mistress. Good. I am simply spreading her message, friend. I worship her through pain, usually my own. But I have a skilled hand when it comes to its infliction. Care to expand your horizons? It will be worth it. You have my word. Mm, I must see this. Don't you dare say no. Sorry, no. Wait, is this a sex thing? Take my armor off? Okay, you're telling me it's not a sex thing, but then you're telling me to take my armor off. As she's drow, I'm sure this is in her wheelhouse. I am curious. Oh, I have something exquisite in mind. Both Loviatar and I are interested in how you handle pain, dear one. A star and stop smirking. And should you delight her, you will most assuredly receive her most gracious blessing. Trust me. Simply face the wall, and we can begin. You told me it wasn't a sex thing! You told me it wasn't a sex thing! Face the wall and let us begin, dear one. Did 
you take off everything? Oh my god. Oh, underwear stays on. I better get mad Astarian approval for this. Goblin's not allowed to be here. Move to the wall and face it, child. Oh. <laughs> the pain you suffer will cleanse you. Do not fight it. Oh no. This is a sex thing. This is a sex thing. <sighs> this is very not her right now. But this is. I think she's really digging down deep and finding that part of herself that let her survive Menzo Branson. Come on. A child can hit harder than that. Oh, we could do charm person. I don't think we're charming him right now. Wow, we're killing it. <laughs> you want more? Sex thing. As you wish, dear one. Would you have joined up with her if you'd known she'd be indulging in this sort of thing, Astarian? I mean, I had my hopes. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful! Just wonderful! Drow are built different. This is like child's play. You look tired. Should I take over? Okay, it's gonna keep our bonuses. We are doing it for Astarian. It's okay, we still got this. Wonderful. You want more? I'll give it to you. My, my. Who knew our friend had so much blood in them? Try not to lick your lips as you say that. <laughs> That's it! Welcome the pain. Let it become part of you. This is a sex thing. Hit me as hard as you can, or I'll return the favor. Let me just channel it again. Oh, that DC, I'm murdering it. Yeah, poor Will is just like... As soon as she starts to take off her clothes, he's like, Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> That's a promise, dear one. <laughs> oh, sweet child, you bore the pain like a true believer. I am proud to have served you this penance. I feel like Belle's like circling her shoulders, flexing her scapula in the back. You could have hit me much harder. You're starting to sound like the goddess herself, dear one. Loviata herself found your performance inspiring. She has deemed you worthy of her blessing. Oh. And on a personal note, thank you. That was positively divine. It's a sex thing. Oh, he beat the fuck out of us, though. And Shadowheart gave us inspiration. Oh, that's going to bruise. Oh, yes. Well, 
Yes, darling. Oh, well, Will just said whatever you're into. Sorry I to cut you off, you Will. You can do the penance thing too. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, what is my buff? Yes, I must try oh. this. Oh, when I have thirty percent hit or points or less. Oh, I get a plus I two to attack rolls. Oh, enjoy. I yes. got the shit beat out of me though. This is perfect. I. I'm gonna get out of the way. Pain is proof that we live. I'm gonna put my clothes back on. <laughs> oh, there's a lot to read in here. Oh, I wanna talk to the rats too. Tend to your can I read it? I can read it. Shall continue. You want? Just bash it somewhere else. Honesty, love, wrath. Many traits are not divine. There's only one that mind. we possess, and the gods do not. Pain. Our most holy mistress invites us to revel in that which makes us mortal. To embrace pain, so she may look upon us and know we are truly living. But what is a life without the sting of agony? without the anguish of a heartbreak. It is a life unlived, a life wasted, hiding from the joys of the world. In Leviathan's name, I ask you to live, to dig your nails into your skin and know that you are alive, to know that the greater the pain, the more exalted the life. Whether your pain comes from claws, the scourge, or an ache in your soul, know that our maiden is watching over you. Tend to your She sees wounds, your suffering. And we shall continue. And she loves you for it. I don't get it! I'm not supposed to be wounded! <laughs> oh my gosh. We have been over this. Okay. Diagrams of bodies twisted into impossible shapes cover the pages while handwritten notes fill the margins. Be wary of your mortal limitations. While it is tempting to allow pain's ecstasies to sweep your you away, particularly during a delicious bout of self-flagellation, broken bones hinder worship of our maiden right of pain. Instead, when the body is spent, for focus on a whipping, or perhaps nail removal. Pliers or blade is recommended to ensure Leviathan may forever revel in your agony, as is her right. Oh. Okay, did I get... I got all the books. We're gonna have Here Will talk to the rats. The rat's nose twitches impatiently. Her teeth bite air as though it is flesh, but it doesn't sate her hunger. Oh. Oh shit, which rat did I talk to? Is it a different rat? Hands off! This, this one's, one's ours. Oh. Okay, sure. No time to rest. Let me guzzle some potions. <sighs> 42 is fine. Jesus. All right. So, we set the boy free. We've got to come and deal with Lolo. One catch a break. Ding. Oh, there you are, Volo. Don't go bothering my pigeon. He's mine. Why don't I have draft things here? So I see. Do you have plans for this pigeon? Keep him safe. Listen to him coo. Till I get hungry or some such. What's it to ya? I hate to see such a lovely creature in a cage. 
Hey, he don't mind. Keeps him safe from me mates. <laughs> Raids make him rabbit. Then catch one on your own. I want this As one. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. No drow. Fine. We'll intimidate. We're laying into our, our uh, Menzo brands and today. I'm done talking. Open the cage or you'll be sorry. Ooh, we don't have it. Oh, yes, we do. We're so worried. All right, all right, calm down. I don't want no trouble. Here's the key. Pigeon's all yours. Thank you. All right, Volo. Oh, there's a bunch of food on the floor. I'm gonna get those sweet potatoes. Oh, sorry, Starion. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> I definitely meant to get these apples, but I'll take it. Ew. Is there stuff in there? Oh, I'm definitely not complaining about Careful, misclicking. I bind. Oh. <laughs> Look at this. I'm quite saved. A joy to see a familiar face in such a precarious setting. I guarantee the story of your daring rescue of my person will live on for eons. Oh, I feel like a starion would, would extort him. So he's going to... Hold a hand out. And request payment for his services. Ah, what's a bit of metal between allies, hmm? I'll do one better. Tell me where we can meet each other once we've slipped the goblin yoke. And I'll offer much more than gold. Knowledge, my friend, is priceless. Volo. I feel like he's gonna roll his eyes gesture over his shoulder, say, go to camp. Smashing! Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. Jeez. I'll slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain! Invisibility potion. Bye! Is that blood? Never mind. Oh. <gasps> Elminster. Is this Volo? Oh, Jesus Christ. Dearest Elminster, I must be brief as I am under some duress, having become the esteemed guest of a rambunctious host of goblins. I would, of course, rather be under duress than under a feathered duvet, for ang uh, danger and adversity are the very ink in my well, so this is good news indeed. As you well know, there is no wit quicker and no tongue more silvered than that of your humble friend and scribe, and by regaling my would-be foes with tales of goblin heroics, I have become an indispensable member of their tribe, namely, their chronicler and bard. In this guise, I shall live among them a while so that I may observe their peculiar habits and rituals as closely as possible. All of this shall, of course, be documented in my next magnum opus, my life among the conquering host, to be available at all good booksellers forthwith. An enticing extract is enclosed with this missive. Why is this man like this? I implore you to spread the words that adventurers and curiosity seekers across the Sword Coast and beyond will be a quiver with anticipation of this life extending and soul enriching guide. And with that, I must depart. I am summoned to sing a ballad of my own composition, and the lady, yes, I shall call her a lady, who delivered the summons is rather impatient, not to mention well armed. Truth be told, I believe she has some, dare I say, deep affection for me. She calls me her pigeon and rarely strays from my side. 
Perhaps there should be a chapter in my book regarding goblin marriage rituals. I book at nothing in my quest for knowledge. Until we meet again, inform the world entire of the diligent research I am undertaking, and ensure word of my upcoming masterwork is on the lips of every innkeep and sellsward from Waterdeep to below. Volo. Volo, why are you like this? That was exhausting, by the way. <laughs> God. Oh, I want to take that with me. Ugh. All right, so. Where's Allison? Please. Oh! I love how that's the... That's the phrase for the stream. That was definitely a sex thing. Doing? Hiding in trees? We'll smoke them out, no problem. Hey, you. I didn't see you could walk you by me. You look like you could kick the ass of half the scrubs in here. <laughs> Bunch of drunken layabouts. No, me, though. I'm hard as they come. And I'm itching for another fight. I'm just trying to find a bear. Under the fight, you should enjoy the spoils of the last one. I've had my fill of feasting. Rest of them can get fat and fuddled. I want to kill something. They're suck ups. Ignore them and be happy they didn't throw you to the spiders yet. Don't worry about the wolves, KV. They won't eat anything what grows in the ground. Might still kill you, mind. Did you just call me KV? Something's on my mind. Heading to see our new pet. It didn't seem easy, I'll give it that. Do you think the dwarf is ready yet? Um, um... Seen this mess? Flaming Fist Thuggo took a chunk out me arm last raid out. Why show me? Go find a healer. Tried the priest. But she says the Absolute will set me right in time for the next raid. We already know about the Flaming Fist. I figure Belle's just gonna shrug. Okay, I'm not gonna bother... Oh, wait, I do have to talk to this rat, though. Foul stench of slaughter turns suddenly sweet through the rat's nose. Blood smell. Life smell. Not like the great hollow below, which smells only of death. Oof. Let's get going. Oh, Leave fuck. me alone! Hello? Ha! Gone here, full ya? Okay. Seems simple enough. Ooh. All right. Oh god, there's a lot. This was an ambitious undertaking. Should mind my step. Yeah, definitely the something is happening auto save. Oh gross. Okay, we're just going to peek in these rooms. Potion of healing. <laughs> Thank you, Cal. <laughs> okay. I don't see a house in. Oh, I don't like that. I hey. Steal something. Or all right the bullets, will ya? I'm itching to throw someone in the brick. It'll be fun. I promise. If you think you could pick me up, you were very mistaken. <sighs> Wait. I see... Those are wargs. <gasps> That's a bear! That's a bear! I 
We're gonna talk to people and then we're gonna go get that bear. And especially Hands off. This one's for the pups. Oh oh, I definitely don't want that. You like to see the bear? Just follow the noise. Warwick's have been going crazy for it. Just hope these scraps will satisfy the bunch when they're in this state. Oh, suspicious meat. Ew. Oh, there's a child. Why is there children? Also, who named their goblin children after numbers? Now we're going to save the game. We're gonna do a big save. We found Halson. We did it. I hope that each and every one of you has a wonderful rest of your day or night. It don't look so scary Whatever now. time it is, wherever you are. And I will see you next time. Always his voice. Thank you guys so much for being so sweet and wonderful. Thank you for being patient. Thank you for helping me hunt down Halson. Next time, we're going to hang out with the first druid. Thanks for watching. For more content, you can check out these videos or my stream on Twitch or my reaction content on TikTok. All the links are in the description. Have a great rest of your day.